We are live! What up, guys? How's it going? Take care of this. Oh, off beat a little bit on your head. That's fine. We'll get rid of that. Um, but, guys, you may have noticed something that is not currently Dimwi. This is actually me reset worm. Um, because Dimwi had a lot of issues with some tech, so the black bar is gone. Ah, uh, so then I'm going to switch over from VML1 to here to help run some cams and make sure that things are running some overlay. And if I want to see this Gravity Virtual game, because it's the one to watch. Uh, honestly, this looks like it's gonna be a good, good game, good matchup. Offbeat, you just watched Gravity play against the might of team. Team. That's right. Team. How did it go? <laughs> I didn't watch it. What happened? It it was it it was a bloodbath. It was it was a gravity by a long shot. Uh, team uh, did put up a much better fight in round two once they probably got a bit warmed up. But uh, yeah, gravity was just firing on all cylinders. Every aspect of their game, at least. In comparison to team, uh, they were looking quite superior and quite uh, in the top of their game. So definitely coming into this one with Vertigo, I mean, you've got the number two, the number three seeds going head to head. Like that's that's what you're after. The, obviously, you jumped over to this channel for this game. You sabotaged Dimwi's equipment. That is why. Clearly, that is right. I, I I just you could see this one. Uh, not doxed him. I I uh, what's, the, what's the word? When you send a load of. Uh, it, it, uh, DDoS. DDoS, 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 yeah, yeah, DDoS them. Yeah, I, 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 I talked to them. DDoS them, we, uh, so that I come over here with you. But I'm, I just learned as well that you're married, which is wild. Ah, uh, yeah. public, but it is now. Sorry, sorry um, to everyone there who was, <laughs> ever, everyone watching who was, who's disappointed. Yeah, well, why am I even here now? Also, we were talking about, uh, <laughs> someone says, I can chat, I can do chat now because this isn't, this isn't venues. Um, wish I could redeem a honey hydrate. Look what I got. It's a coffee. And it is. Look at this lovely mug. Thank you so much. This cost me 15 quid yesterday. Um, have you sent the ping yet, Offbeat? I have sent the ping. Let's go. Just did. Let's go. Um, yeah, this is my, my new mug. And it, <laughs> it's honey colored. And it, look how nice it is. 15 quid on this. 15 quid. What an absolute scam. But, you know, it's nice. Anyway. Um, <laughs> God, Coffee like, drinkers going... will do anything. <laughs> will we'll pay any amount for their accessories. <laughs> it's so pretty. It's such a pretty <laughs> mug. It's I like it. it. It makes me like happy when it sits on my desk and I'm like, damn dude. Looks like honey. 
as we're gonna run in here. Oh, oh my stats working. They're not working. Oh, guess he never started Spark, dude. I jumped in here last minute. All right, so uh, don't hate me. Uh, I took over Dimwi, and so while I'm taking over Dimwi, take us in off beats. Tell us what's going on. Yeah, uh, first chance of the game really coming in there from Vertigo as they had that long shot and not quite able to connect. And now we've got the counterattack from Team Gravity looking to capitalize. They've got the three on two. They've got the goalie stunned. And that's going to be JBLB uh, putting that in, getting the first points of the game for Gravity. Looking to pick up right where they left off. Uh, nice quick goal, 25 seconds in. Uh, lots, lots of time still to go as we're only uh, still got nine and a half minutes to go. Lots of exciting action still. Yeah, lots indeed. It's going to be a nice fun. Oh, I just realized uh, the teams are the right around as well, which is incredible. Um, I had the wrong overlay on. What are you on about, Summer? Which I think you have the wrong overlay on. Is this the wrong around? Oh, no. you've got you've got your uh, you've hit hit you. You've got the you've got the oh, in-game overlay. Oh shoot! <laughs> oh hell, dude! Oh no! I forget. Oh, it's because right when I when I can when I'm like running casting, I, I always have them on because of course you do. You don't want to see the names. But when I'm running cams, I just forget they need to be off. Um, but hey, we're back. Don't worry about that. Ah, as a goddess! Oh! Thank you so much, um, there is a dunk coming in here. That is a nice way to start us off. Team Gravity bringing off this, this game. And you know what? We need to talk about this. We need to talk about what's going on right now. All right? Screw the overlays. Screw my coffee mug. 15 pounds. Very nice. Thank you so much for everything. Um, Vertigo and Gravity. Obviously, two teams that came from Gravity. Gravity last season. Absolute powerhouse. Every season. Won every single time. And then now they decided to split into two. Uh, I'm not entirely sure why. Probably for the competition. But Gravity and Vertigo. Old versus new. Let's see who's going to come out on top yeah i mean probably did it honestly just uh for for the league they're like you know it's a little boring winning every time got to make it a little exciting as a good little defensive stack there by vertigo is going to pick that up and they're going to get the clear they're on their way to the stack no not a clear that one's going to bounce all the way in taking a few wild uh ricochets and vertigo finally getting their first points of the round with that long three just what they needed here cutting that lead to one yeah, cutting that lead to one single point apart. Definitely looking kind of close here. Although Gravity got those two points, that one free point is so significant. And oh my god, I didn't even turn the camera out of time, but already they're on the disc. Vertigo going for the attack, going for the shot, going for the goal! Vertigo, in the 30 seconds, bring this game back. They've gone from being four down to one up. That's a turnaround. I mean, look at that. You can see them coming in on goal, realizing we've got all the time in the world. You take the shot. You take the shot. No, you take the shot. Uh, eventually getting it in after a good number of back and forths, making sure that the assist is counted on that one. As a, ooh, getting around that stack nicely is a Viatrex getting the pass up to JBLB, who's going to reset it. And uh, Team Gravity just looking to slow this one down uh, after giving up those few quick goals as they're going to keep it moving, avoiding that stack, passing it back and forth. Looking to see if they can get a break, and uh, nope, that's going to be a mistaken pass as it uh, the pressure from the stack does get to them, and uh, Galti is going to clear it all the way up to the midfield. Yeah, up to the mid, the stack though, charging in, getting the start off in time once, twice, but get does not steal it away in time. As they chase down, there's Steph, no, Simon, oh my god, not again. I, <sighs> the names are small, and in this overlay, I keep calling Simon Steffo. I, I, I cannot get out of it. Last game, I cast of Gravity, I called Simon Steffo, or Vertigo, um, like 20 times. And I'm so sorry. Anyway, uh, as they walk up here, I'm never going to get mistake again, because here comes the attack coming in from Lowrider. Lowrider getting that clear through all the way. All the way upfield. This could be good for them. Now they take it in. No! No! Simon! Not Steffo is there on time, but the stun comes out, and so does the clear. Yeah, great little rush back. Very important. It's here they come back the other way, and it's going to be JBLB gets the defensive stop on one end with that stun, and then just right back the other way with that quick two. Uh, as the lead changes again for, I think, the third time so far this game, as uh, it's going to be Gravity sneaking back up by a uh, one-point lead now. We'll see how long uh, that one lasts before uh, Vertigo uh, is able to possibly claw their way back into that first place, uh, <laughs> that that lead, as uh, it's passed up ahead to Simon, who's going to look to take it in with some helpful stuns coming in from Galti. Yeah, helpful stuns. They take that one. It... What? The Simon in the chat? How did you do that? Is that the real Simon? Did you type that out? <laughs> did you really do that in between? 
There's no way. Surely not. There's no way that Simon actually typed that out that fast, right? Bingo. Oh my god, the goal comes in. I'm distracted by the fact that Simon shot that. Simon, if you're doing it again, you're doing it actually, Twang, is that actually legit? I've been told this before, but I didn't think it was legit. Nine, eight, That's mad. Seven, six, wow. Five, All right. Impressive. Four, three, <laughs> Welcome to our stream here with a retap, the most distractible caster, uh, <laughs> EU, NA, across the board. <laughs> Look, when one of the players I call out immediately responds in the chat, you can't not, like comment on that you can't kind of be like oh sure yeah that player is just like you know playing the game and also typing they only need one hand to play but hey only one hand to save as well scubs have a goal to take that one clearing it through but simon is there again to recover it once again yeah simon passing it up and out to galti who's got some space is trying to lead his teammate ahead and is going to get it to low rider a couple of them in the zone they are going to reset it back because the defense for gravity is all set up in the zone so there'll be simon kind of patrolling the back line looking around seeing what he have what he has got a fake pass in there got an actual one up to sky trench and it's going to be lomos moving in up nest anyone going to pressure him no one no great save by viatrex there he says we don't need the defense i'll stop this all on my own uh they get it out of da the immediate danger as uh, simon with it now uh looking for another pass goes for that cut but scubs another great read to jump in front of that one get it out of harm's way yeah nice one man fortunately nearly had that one but they do have it again we do have Vertigo taking this one up. The shot down below, and there is the three points they need to get that one in. That is going to mean they are now four points up and definitely looking very clean this early. Yeah, Simon, Vertigo doing all... Sorry, in the chat again. <laughs> that is so impressive. I'm going to watch you next time the goal scored. I'm going to watch Simon. What number is Simon? Let's find out. Uh, Welcome to Simon Watch here on VRML2. I need to... Hang on. I need to set everybody on a second. No, no, no. There he is. There he is. All right, all right, all right. I'll work it out, I'll work it out, hang on. And, oh, never mind, alright, there's, there's Chad. Blow right out of the goal, coming in! Where's Simon, where's Simon? I gotta, I gotta find out. Uh, Simon is... What's that, nine? Alright, Simon's on a nine. Hmm, alright, alright, not, not, not there yet. <laughs> Ninja thing. <laughs> Sorry, get back, go on. Teams have cleared the launcher. Uh, Retap, wanna take this one as I figure out why my game has crashed? Your game has crashed? Oh no! Uh, uh, that's right, I uh, will take it then. Um, as it works one out there, Simon this again. Simon, is he typing? Is he currently typing? No, he's not he's shooting his cop. Uh, that could be in, but it doesn't matter there. That one definitely is. As, uh, quick. Is he typing? Is he currently typing? He is, he's typing! <laughs> Check if he's we typing mid-cast. Call him out! What are you, it's not him, it's not gonna be him. It There's is. no way he'd be he, listening he, he to just you. did it, he There's just not. did it. Lucky. He's got a friend or something doing it for him, I swear. Yeah, There's lucky, no chance it is. He, if it is genuinely the him, then it's actually impressive. I just no watched it happen. Right? I watched it happen, all right? I, I, you're so seamless, like, like jumping in there with that. It was so seamless. But I watched it. <laughs> I decided, like, I call him out on it. I'm watching him. I'm going to do it next time. Because I didn't believe it either. And then people were like, Twang and Winter were like, it is him. And, oh, okay, I was getting, oh. ready. I was getting ready to uh, uh, to watch him again, but we're not yet. Right here. Um, you, you watch him for a bit, you watch the chat, and I can I can I'll, talk I'll, about I'll, the game. I'll, 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 as soon as the goal <laughs> okay. scored, we're going to jump over to him. We're going to watch, because last time I saw him do it. As here comes the That's disc good. into the... Sounds, sounds side. like a good plan. Taking out again. No, there's a tag. There's a, oh, never mind. There's a stun. Oh! It was waiting, I'm waiting for the goal now so I can see it. Uh, as the Raider <laughs> takes it down, and there's a nice clear through. No typing yet, unfortunately. Yeah, uh, JBLB doing a good job to get back there, but the stun coming in with a lot of pressure has forced the steal. Simon up to low rider, low rider, and making no mistake there, putting in the three. Here's the after that, Oh, there we go. Do we have him? Eyes down? Uh, maybe not, maybe not, maybe not last time. <laughs> And then there's a uh, message to point out. I, I saw no, you know, he didn't type there, and there was no message. I'm telling you, it's legit. Go on, sorry. All right, Vertigo uh, <laughs> turning it around after that uh, slow start. Probably just needed a little bit of time to get warm up, but they have been rolling here with uh, eight up 18 to six now. 30 seconds left. Lowrider just gonna take time, dance around a little bit. Cause oh. what's the rush? Ooh, dings it off the ring. Nearly able to get that one up to 20 points. Uh, but no, it's going to be Baguette picking it up. Here comes the stack the other way. Are they able to find it? Oh, what a great save by Galti. As that was just about to bounce in off of Sky Trench all the way from their own end of the field. As Scubs has it, they're looking for one more point as we get 10 seconds left. 
It's gonna bounce up high. No one immediately close to it. Scub's looking for that slap, but no. Great little stun by Lomos. And they're gonna get it cleared away, and that will do it. Round one in the books. Uh, after a slow start, Vertigo taken with a very dominant 18-6 win. Yeah, so, so dominant. Lucky, are you here right now? Lucky, are you? I am, if I can manage to unmute my mic without missing it three times. Congratulations. Yeah, I, I am here. You did it. You did it. First time this <laughs> Managed time. to plug in a whole PC to just get here and uh, just chill like, out with you guys and watch your game. You've, you've yeah, fully, fully. An entire new PC in. It's a new PC. I was, I was on, before I was on a different PC when I was in the school and it was not working. So I just said, you know what? I'll plug in the other one. Um, right, this, so and, and, and this one's working. One. Uh, yeah, this so, one's all good. We're all good now. All right, sweet. So you're watching the game. Go on. I don't yeah. know how much you've seen. What is going on uh, here? I've oh. seen a couple minutes, and overall, it's like, it's good from both teams, but it's what you expect from Vertigo. Vertigo has taken Wait, so many rounds with so many teams. They are considered at the moment to be, like, top two, if not number one, in EU here, and they are, like, incredible as a team. They have just a perfect amount of chemistry, and it's it's most of the players from that old Gravity team. If you're actually looking at the only player from that old Gravity, <laughs> Gravity team, that is still on actually team gravity is just viatrex obviously the captain and other than that they've had mostly switch around so you got to rebuild that chemistry but then goldsy as well has played with these players a long time and lomos simon and lowrider all ex-members of gravity all really strong players and they have they're definitely showing it now and they're gonna keep hammering through this competition towards the finals i'm expecting yeah, I'm, I'm thinking that too. I realized right at the end of that, like half through that, I just watched Simon the entire time and not put it to the uh, game win screen. Um, I was too attracted by the fact that he was typing. But did you see? He said what, that they're watching me type. It is Simon, I'm telling you, I believe in it. Um, anyway, um, yeah, I mean, absolutely right. The, the, the experienced players from Vertigo is definitely showing here, but they have time still. And like that, Gravity is going to pull that one back for a nice early one. And they do get two points. Oh, exactly what exactly what gravity needed here to turn this around. You definitely got to start this one off uh, with a bang, considering how that second round ended. And a great little play there, good recovery, good stacks uh, to beat down Vertigo back to their goal and tuck that away for a nice easy uh, two points. As it is going to be now, Vertigo with the disc looking left tunnel, but no uh, baguette there, able to make the interception. They've got a few team members in there quick if they can score before the defense get back. As Viatrex underneath the goal sending it back, no, and as the defense falls back. So they too will fall back and Scubs now at Trench looking for an in. Yeah, looking for an in. Passed along there. Passing back again as they can. There's Baguette. Scubs, Scubs get stunned, but Vizek's there in time to recover it. And they score that one in. A nice goal is going to bring them back. Now, 4 0. Yeah, uh, Gravity looking looking pretty sharp out of the gates here. You got to wonder if uh, they've made any adjustments over the break that have really been helping them out here. Uh, because right now, Vertigo has not really been able to get too much going here. Let's see if they're able to get out of the zone this time, because uh, they were struggling with that before. It looks like they're going to take a bit of a slower approach here with a safer pass to Simon. They're going to get it over over center, and it's going to be Galti with the disc, looking to Lowrider. Lowrider's got some space, makes a good pass before the stack can get to him, and they'll reset it all the way back up near Popcorn. Where Simon is going to take it, and he will look to set up the Vertigo offense. Yeah, nice one back there. Very spread out. You can see on the minimap the little square position. That square attack formation that, that was so popular at the minute. As they do take that one up, Lomos above the goal. Working out to the cut there. Goldie, Goldie underneath there to Lowrider. And oh my god, <laughs> every single member of the player of the team got the disc on that attack and they made it happen. Yeah, and uh, you'll see from some teams if they're moving the disc around like that, it's like everyone could take the shot, but they decide to pass this one. Every pass there was necessary and was a good pass. Just looking to find that teammate who had a good angle on the goal, finally taking it when they had that opportunity. So there wasn't even any showboating there or, or just excess passing. It was all necessary and it was all done expertly as they kept that disc moving, kept the gravity uh, defense on their toes and off balance. As now gravity uh, moving the other way, they've got it underneath the goal. Would just be a one and one, but no, instead they are looking to pass it back, but the reset's gonna go a little too far. Uh, Team Gravity helped out by a nice, uh, helpful bounce there uh, to slow up Vertigo and make Vertigo kind of take some time to set up as Simon, though, finds Lomos, who's got a lot of space, moving in, he's gonna take the shot, and he's gonna bounce it in right before the stack gets to him. Perfect timing there by Lomos, Simon getting the assist, and we are all tied up at four. Yes, we are tied up at four. Four points is the number we are tied up at. I got attracted thinking of thinking, there he is, there he is, he's there! 
I'm telling you, it's Simon. Um, I am always excited about this, the fact that someone's typing. It's Summer, if you're watching this, see, it could be worse. Um, but uh, they are taking the attack right now, working up. Scubs going for a nice shot. That's good. DBLB taking that one back to a nice little reset out to Baguette. Down below. Can they work this one up? They go for below the goal, but no, Scobbs just missed that one barely, unfortunately, and so it is going to get accidentally cleared out. There's the stack, taking it down again. Scobbs once again recovering, tapping it back, and then disc is open. The goal's open, and the shot goes <laughs> in! And then Vitek celebrating there. They know it's going to happen. Three points, now back on top. Oh, that play entirely made right there at the beginning by Scubs was 1v4 in that tunnel is the only Team Gravity member who was able to get around to that and slap it back to his team and a good recognition uh, to let the three-pointer go in so that they can grab the three-point lead because in this game where it's been so much back and forth, I would not at all be surprised if that one point ends up making a difference here as it is going to be Vertigo kind of stuck in the midfield looking to get it up. It's Simon with a disc facing down the stack. And he's faking a pass, looking back. Not under a ton of immediate pressures. The sacks kind of give him a little space to work. And he'll make his way up over his center very casually, reset it back. And uh, now it'll be Alomos who is going to send across. Not quite able to connect there, though. And it is going to be JBLB picking up the disc. Not holding onto it, though, as a Galti with a good steal. Not able to finish, though. JBLB is going to take it back and clear it at least up to midfield. Yeah, up to midfield there, the get with the disc now, taking that one up, sending it through, JVLB passing on to their teammates, working it up there, the pass again, but get takes a zero angle, and but get gets it done! This one is cooking, and they're now they're working that back to a 4-9. to nine. Grouty, bringing back the second round, with a vengeance right now, as the first half of the second round has gone. Yeah, it's it's been exactly what they've needed because they've got to pull a reverse sweep here if they want to if they want to stay alive in this tournament. And a good slap all the way through is going to make it all the way to Galti, who's got it and will take some time as he's got three uh, members of gravity on him. They are going to steal it. They're looking for that long three and Baguette uh, just going to continue that scoring run now with 10 points on the day. Uh, more scoring than the rest of the team combined as Team Gravity continues to run, running up their lead to eight points now. Eight points. Definitely looking good here. Definitely looking very, very clean as they bring this one up. But there's low right of the disc. Taking hands. Looking for a pass. Going to take their time as they walk it up. There's a nice one. No! It does bounce. They recover it in time. The stack is on them. But they are getting the passing off in time as Lomos walks it up. There's the shot. One on one. Good looking instead for that pass across the teammate. But unfortunately, now a little bit too far ahead of them. Just brushed past fingers and now he's going to get cleared away. Can the stack get there in time? Gravity's chasing it down. Lowrider losing that disc over there to DBLB. DBLB sending that one through all that field for a nice clear. Yeah, great clear. And uh, it hurts to watch as Vertigo was really having some trouble there uh, with their pass accuracy. They've been losing a few of them, a few of these runs because of pass accuracy issues. You've got to see them tighten that up. Because this is uh, the top teams in EU Master. And so if you're not able to finish those, you are going to have some trouble closing out games. as a long clear getting all the way through. Uh, but getting back to it is that defensive stack. Lomos with the disc. Uh, and he's going to move it up to Simon, who's going to clear it all the way down into the gravity. And, and it's going to bounce all the way in. The, not bounce all the way in. The pass to Lowrider, who turns around and snipes that open three. Exactly what Vertigo needed. Cutting that lead to five. Three minutes left to play. Ooh, what a shot that was. That was a nice one. Uh, someone put this curve on. Simon, how do you have time to type this much? There is like... <laughs> it must Sounds be exactly right? like what a fake Simon would say. No, no, no. Uh, no I'm going to watch. <laughs> right. Um, oh, whatever. Look, the point is, there's the Ryan taking the disc in very nicely. Is Simon, is Simon, is Simon going to type? No, damn. Uh, it's, it's, no. Oh, um, regardless, I need to stop obsessing over this because this is just dumb at this point. Uh, three points. <laughs> three points apart. I mean, nine. No, what? Not nine. Two minutes to go. Three points apart. One three point is going to put them back to even. As Laura is going to get this. No, they do recover it in hand. They do not get stunned out. A nice reset there. It's Golty. Golty passing up. One defender is back. That means they only have two defenders upfield. But unfortunately, they still cannot find the open pass. Instead, it is going to get knocked away out of their hands. Davy LB with a long, long shot bouncing up. There is Golty taking the disc back again. There's a lot of pressure on these guys right now, all around. As there is now less than two minutes left. One minute 45. 
Still plenty of time here for Vertigo to win this one back, but Gravity have the disc. They just need to hold out for that time. Yeah, if Gravity can make a nice slow push here and then get a point with like a minute or so left, they will be really in the driver's seat as that two score lead would be Im pretty immense. As now underneath the goal, it is Baguette with a lot of space and Baguette is gonna put that in for two points. That's exactly what we were talking about. Take their time, look for the opening and now a five point lead with a minute 20 left. Uh, not impossible, but uh, it does seem to indicate that we Put are going to be heading to a round three here, unless Vertigo can pull something really incredible out right now. Yes, <laughs> yes, Retap, I see. I see in the chat. Did you're you you're very excited that Simon is back. <laughs> Loki, Loki, if you're here, did you see that? Uh, yeah, but like... What are you on about? He lives... All right, no. It is, it is, it is, but like, come on. But is it that like... exciting? No, it is. It's like, it's ridiculous. No, that's ridiculous. The fact that he's literally, he, I don't know if you've played an elite cup before or a challenger cup or anything like this or a finals, but you don't do that. You don't, you don't relax so much that you're typing in chat whilst playing exactly. the actual tournament. It is ridiculous. It's, it's quite impressive. It's quite funny to see. Dude, exactly. That's what I mean, right? The, the amount of confidence you've got to have to be like, as soon as the point's over, you just jump in the chat and just send a little message over because, you, you know, you're just doing so good. You know what you're doing. The, and the problem is this time they don't have the game on their hand. He's still doing it. He's still experienced enough, but maybe he shouldn't be because right now they are going to be 10 points down in the last, last what, 10 seconds of this one. And that means the round is going to be going to gravity. It is going to be a round free guarantee. The question is, do you think he uh, has the stream audio up while he's playing? Do you think he's got his teammates in one ear and, and, and us in the other ear? <laughs> No, no <laughs> chance. I, I hope not. I really hope not. Because I mean, that would be amazing if you did. That would be so impressive. If you've got abilities to like be able to focus on the stream and your teammates and still be doing this well. Um, he's, he's he's listening to us, looking for looking for tells, looking for ins on uh on what gravity is doing, what we're seeing from our uh, omniscient perspective. You probably just look around though, right? I mean, I'm sure you can just see. Um, lucky though, <laughs> lucky. <You're here. laughs> you are definitely omnipotent right now. Uh, what are you uh, saying? Yeah, it's just you can see the confidence that's coming in from Simon especially and like if he is genuinely typing in chat then he, he has that confidence. He's not concerned about a round three and we know what Vertigo can do. Vertigo can do amazing things and the fact is that I've seen a huge amount of whiffs from Vertigo that round. So maybe they were taking it a bit less seriously because they knew that they had this third round behind them and that they could be playing as serious as possible in this third round. But something's happened in that second round. I'm not saying that they weren't trying. I'm sure they were in so many ways but they're definitely going to have to step up their game this time. They're, this round, they're going to have to put their rule into it if they want to beat a team such as Gravity because they are doing so well right now. And a, a crucial thing is the three points is coming in from both sides, but more primarily, it's from the side of Gravity. And these three pointers that keep hammering in are just the amount of points that that's racking up is ridiculous. You score a couple twos, it doesn't mean much, but the point difference was so huge due to those threes. Yeah, no, absolutely, absolutely agree, man. Uh, we'll see what happens now in this final round where it matters as... Oh, not a free, but straight two. Vertigo takes that one immediately with confidence. And in, what was that? Like, five seconds? They got that Five seconds. In. I mean, that's that's the impact of uh, getting off of Twitch and uh, focusing on the game, I imagine. <laughs> <laughs> As uh, team captain Colin Simon back in. And Simon immediately getting on the board with the, with the assist there. His... Seventh assist of the game so far. He's been doing a great job of finding uh, those scorers uh, as Lowrider and Lomos with 17 and 10 points respectively as they're just getting fed by Simon. But it's Baguette now <clears throat> losing the disc out to Simon and Lomos as they got that stack going. Oh, the little little uh, bounce to the side. They've got a three and one and that's going to be put in. Simon getting just a second goal of the game. It's been a little more, a little more sharing for the rest of it. But hey, quick four nothing lead for Vertigo. That's what they're looking for. That is what they're looking for. A completely different round three. Ten points down last round. And this one, they're coming in way, way stronger. Uh, maybe right. Maybe it was just that phone. Maybe he was just, like, not ahead in the game. Too relaxed last round. But this round, <laughs> definitely not. There he goes. That's the man we're talking about right now. That's the man scoring those goals. Another two points up. Versco have definitely, yeah, relaxed the first round. Or, or you know. Put in the work first round, relax second round, and then round three they decided to absolutely punch, and they are hitting hard. Yep, as Simon says, this is their round for the win. 
<laughs> as I'm, I'm learning over my time here as a VML, VRML caster, uh, that puns are, are absolutely the way to go. It's the only way to call a game. So I definitely am looking to step up that game. As I get now with the disc under, he's going to reset it back. Uh, sent right back in, though. Very nice, accurate pass to Scubter, who's looking for the bounce. Isn't quite going to get it. And that stack coming back. It's going to be Lowrider with the disc. Looking to clear. Doesn't get all the way out, though. Uh, it is going to hit Bowtie. But that's good enough as Galti there with the stack is going to clear it deep all the way. And it's bouncing in towards the goal. Just going to miss. And that defense, particularly from Baguette, is going to get back and put it right back the other way. Yeah, right back where it came from now. We've got to crack down on this game because this is actually looking like a really, really good round three. As Vertigo have their eye on the prize, eye on the ball right now as they are taking this game much more seriously. Put in the work. And um, wow, that was an instant slap that he makes there. So clean, no must pick that one up. One on one on the goalie, one on two, sorry. They think they want to even do. Scubs gets the save just in time. Take that one through again. It is going to go up field all the way, bouncing down below. Oh, I can barely even follow the action of the camera right now as Baguette is so fast here. The goal, taking that one in and for the first point of the round. Team Gravity, get this one in. Yeah, a uh, great, great save by Scubs on the back end to kind of start that playoff. Gets the perfect clear. That's exactly what you're looking for out of the clear. If you are a goalie, if you play goalie on your team, take note of that. Look at that angle that he gets on that clear. Sets up Baguette perfectly. Uh, it's a nice, uncomplicated bounce, so he doesn't have to, Baguette doesn't have to do a lot to read it. Uh, gets exactly where it needs to be and makes it just the easiest goal in the world uh, once they've gotten there. And it's Baguette, again, looking to clear here. Is going to get it all the way through the middle, dodging and past those members. Uh, it's bouncing down. Open is right in front of the goal for the finish. And Baguette... Gonna finish that one again, and just like that, gravity, looking to looking to make a game of this. Yeah, looking to make a game of it for sure. They're they're looking like a uh, absolutely bringing this one back. Just two points apart now. I thought we were gonna see Vertigo taking this game away and just running with it. But Gravity is definitely holding them down a little bit right now. They're holding this game back in their hands as Simon is going to work that one back. Pass again to Simon. Golty to Simon. Golty again. And back down to the floor. The passes are impeccable. Again, they've set up that square formation we saw earlier. Two at the front, two at the back. Working down again. Now they're working forward. And now they're going for the attack. They're going aggressive. And immediately it works out for them. Lowrider takes that one in behind the goal for a nice two. Yeah, great uh, work by Lomos to realize that the cut pass at first wasn't there and to have the patience to to buy some time and to wait to find Lowrider getting open behind the goal. And that worked out perfectly for them as they regain a four-point lead here, a crucial two-score lead. Uh, now as Gravity with the disc is going to be trying to work their way up and keep this game, get it back to within one is Vitrex. Going to pass it to JBLB. JBLB looking to clear it off the off the far tunnel and we'll end up getting it all the way down is that going in that is going in that was a goal from the left tunnel to the right tunnel and into the goal what yeah yeah insane insane these guys are so insanely good at what they're doing right now they have the absolute control over this and they have the skill to get this one happening as they do take that one in um, it back the other way. I mean, it's insane though that the stuff's effect. happening right now. This is round three. This is one point apart. This is the second half of round three. It's looking like a really, really close game. As they work this one up, taking it around. There's Bayer. Taking that one down below on the other side. Working it in, but Gat takes that one in, scores the goal. That means they're back on the lead. Gravity have taken this lead back by one point. Oh, the defense there, uh, getting a little, a little uh, disc happy, looking to move in on the disc instead of covering that cut pass. You could see uh, Viatrex's eyes just light up uh, when, when, when being left alone on the side there, uh, made for a nice, easy cut pass and a good, quick finish there. As a uh, team, Gravity uh, definitely have done a great job to fight their way back into this game, but they're gonna have to hurry back now. As Galti is open in space, he's got two teammates coming in, lots of time, and that's not gonna be good enough. As uh, Scubs not able to stop the three on one, and uh, Vertigo gonna take the lead back now. We got four minutes left. How many more lead changes can we get in these last four minutes? I'm gonna, I'm gonna hope we get at least four more. I think oh, that's definitely doable. We can definitely get four more here. I mean, four minutes, one minute goal. If they go back and forth goals again, we're going to see loads and loads. But there's no monster disc. Back in hand again. Pass now and back. Nice reset. Ooh. No, no, the reason gets stunned down. Instead, the baguette is able to just take that one in and just get the goal. That is so unfortunate. That is not what you want to see at all going in. But it is what has happened here for them. Unfortunate. But hey, 
Plenty of time here. Plenty of time as they do need to get some back. They are now one point in the lead once again. Oh, that's got to be a terrifying feeling as the goalie. You see the reset pass coming back to you slow, and the enemy team stack just storming at you full speed. Not much you can really do there uh, in that situation to come out on top. Best you can really do is hope to stall, and yeah, it wasn't enough as the stack did get in there and finish that one off very nicely as Simon looking up to Lowrider now, and they are going to reset it back and take it up a little more slowly. Uh, Galti keeping his eyes up, just looking for those options. Find Simon on the other side of Bowtie. Uh, back cross to Galti. Galti's got a man open on top. That's Lomos. Lomos looking and moves past the goalie and going to put that in for our third uh, lead change in the last minute and a half. Wow, third in a minute and a half. That's ridiculous. <laughs> We're definitely going quick. Hey, I think we can definitely reach that four that you were looking for um, very, very, very soon. As here we go for this one right now. I believe that the other channel is now watching us. I could be wrong, but I will check that in a second. Hey, guys. From VML uh, Master League from Venues. Come watch us. We're the better channel anyway. We're the better ones to watch. You should definitely stick here. As we do have an attack coming in. And no, TBLB takes that one one-on-one on the goalie. And they take it in. Straight past Simon. Gravity with the lead now. Once again, back and forth. Four lead changes in the last two minutes. Neither defense really able to get a foothold here as it's really just going to come down. To, if they keep trading like this, it's going to come down to clock management. You're going to get the disc here down one and they're going to need to make sure that they score with not enough time left on the clock for a counter attack. As here comes Vertigo back the other way. Look at that long three, but no. Uh, <laughs> I did not realize that Scubs was back there, uh, but great low play by Scubs to stop that long three. Vitrax is going to send this all the way. Are they going to be able to take a two-score lead? They are! It's JBLB putting that in. Not a two-score lead, but a three-point lead, which is crucial. Minute and a half left to go in a very close round three. For those of us just joining, each team has taken a round so far, and this is the winner moves on, loser goes home round. Yeah, it absolutely is. It's the one who's going to be in finals against uh, somebody. Who is it? Off beat tech for me, would you? Um, as we go up here, the attack comes in and there is going to be the attack going in. Simon of the disc. Simon taking it up above. No! What happened? What happened? What, what, what was that? Oh my goodness. I watch that oh, that's... That, that's so wow. to drop it. I watch the replay oh, now. Here we come the other way again. It's going to be Simon. Simon a two on one, three on one taking his time, <laughs> low, waiting for that stun so he could get the three because uh, that three was pretty crucial. But no, that's going to get cleared all the way out, bouncing down into trench. Uh, Simon is able to get back to first. Oh, has no. a... <laughs> no, the internet issue is a... oh, <laughs> as, no. as it comes in. And it's going to be Baguette with the stun, with the goal. Up five oh. points, 30 seconds left. That will do it. That's it. That's it. Gravity's just taking that one. So unlucky that a swing, swing, swing from Simon was a little bit too much. Disc flew out the hands. You've been typing too much on his phone, Twitch said. And unfortunately, <laughs> that does mean they are going to lose that disc. And then from the lag out, that means they do lose the entire round. As to the six point lead is going to be too much. The last five seconds ticking down here. Barjack sends up on through. But ladies and gentlemen, we do have the our final team here who is going to be going to finals. It is Team Gravity coming in from a round one near loss. Round two, very clean win, and then round three, bringing that one back to get that one in hand. Guys, we're going to have an absolutely insane, <laughs> insane finals coming up right now. Uh, we've got, who is it? It's going to be Gravity versus uh, whoever won the last one. Who won the last one? Does anyone know? I, Blast versus... Fine. Is it Blast chat, most chat. likely? Probably Blast. It'll be Blast most likely. Yeah, that's the more likely one. But I don't know. It could be the other team. I don't know who they went up against. That's insane. That's so good. Snack, Gravity snack, versus Blast. Gravity and Blast. Yeah. Okay, we'll yeah, trust Gravity you, Snack. We'll trust you. Gravity versus <laughs> Blast is going to be the final matchup coming in just a moment to see who is going to be the top place in this. It could have been Vertigo. It was so, so unlucky there. Can Gravity take this one? They always used to um, keep that high position of like highest in AU. They've always had always Blast going to go and take it away from them. We'll have to see. Don't go I suspect that one's going to be on the VR Master League channel. So hop over there. Uh, we'll, we'll read them in a second and we'll see you all there. Wait, I'm pretty sure that is that. Oh, we'll say it's that. 